All right, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do this quick picture flip effect in After Effects. All right, first thing what we wanna do is go to our composition and do new composition and set your settings how you want for the aspect ratio. I'm gonna do 1920 by 1080. I'm gonna hit okay. And I'm gonna grab these 10 images and bring them into my comp. Next thing what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have to scale each one accordingly because they're all different sizes. So what I'll do is I'll hit this little eye right here to deselect them. So I'm gonna select this one, hit S on my keyboard and scale this one accordingly. And I'm gonna go through each image and do that. Okay, so after that, I'm gonna deselect this one really quick and then I'm gonna select all of them, hit the eye so they're all selected together. And I'm going to hold down command and hit right arrow one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I'm gonna hit option and close bracket. And then I'm gonna hit hold down command again and use left arrow and go over one space. Then we will hit P on our keyboard to uh, bring up the position. And I'm gonna hit this stopwatch and it's gonna, since all of them are selected, it's gonna affect all of them. Drag this to the front and I'm gonna drag these images up. And next what we're gonna do is select all the keyframes, right, cl right click, go to keyframe assistant easy ease we're gonna go over here to motion blur make sure that's uh selected for all the clips and then we're gonna right click again and we are gonna go to keyframe assistant and sequence layers you want to make sure that overlap is selected so i'm gonna hit okay now i'm gonna hit p on my keyboard just so the position goes away and you'll see that the effect is taking place i'm gonna shorten the work area a little bit though now what we want to do is with all of them still selected, I'm going to right click, pre-compose, move all attributes, hit OK. Now what we want to do is right click, go to time, enable time remapping, and I'm going to speed this up a bit because it felt a little too slow. So let's see how that feels. That feels a lot better. I'm going to trim this up now a bit. And we're going to do one more thing to add a little flare to this clip. What we want to do is Right click new adjustment layer and I'm going to go over one, two, three, four. We don't need this part, so I'm going to delete it. I'm going to go to the middle right here. I'm going to go to my effects and I'm going to type in Lumetri color. Drag that onto our adjustment layer. Right here, I'm going to just pull up so it's easier to do. We want to go to light. I'm going to go to my exposure here, my stopwatch, and I'm going to go up to about five or six. Go to the front, bring that back to zero. Go right here, bring that down to zero. And I'm gonna stretch this out to the very end. Hold down Command and D to duplicate. And I'm just gonna kind of spread this out. And I'll play the effect for you guys. And here we go. And that's how we do it.